Hi everyone, welcome to the Curbside Pickup Craft. Today we are making a cat in the hat um, craft because this past week on March 2nd was um, Dr. Seuss's birthday. Um, so I thought it would be fun to make one of his characters, Cat in the Hat. Um, and actually I have the Cat in the Hat book with me. This is a fun book to read, especially if you like rhymes. Um, so yeah, and if you don't want to read this book, we also do have plenty of books with rhyming. I love books that rhyme. I, I find it so fun to read, especially out loud. I love to hear the different words that rhyme. Um, so yeah, let's get started with our craft. Um, so you're gonna pull out all your pieces for your craft in your baggie. Um, there's plenty of different sort of pieces. Um, we have um, a bow and we have red and white paper and then we have pipe cleaner for um, the cat in the hat's whiskers. Ah, there we go. So we're gonna get all our pieces out and then also um, you're going to need a glue bottle and a marker but like I always say you can use any color marker you want you don't have to use black whatever you have at home works okay okay so first we are going to glue on his eyes so you're going to add a little glue on the face you're going to grab your googly eyes Right. Mm -hmm. Sometimes you have to move around your googly eyes so that way the eyes are where you want them to be. Okay? Um, and then you're going to grab your blue pom pom. That is his nose. Now, just so you know, when it comes to the pom pom and the pipe cleaner, you have to kind of press down and um, to make them stick down to the paper. All right, there we go. You're gonna add a little glue by his nose. So the pipe cleaner could go right there for his whiskers. One, two, ooh. see the pipe cleaner kind of moves a lot, so you have to be a little bit careful. Um, and then let it dry, this project dry in a safe place because it does move around easily when it's not dry. Ooh. You know, I'm gonna lower his nose a little bit. I think it's a little bit too close to his eyes, so. Add a little bit more glue. One and two. Pass it down. You might get a little glue on your fingers, but that's okay. That's why we have soap and water, right? Do it again. This might need a little more glue. Whoop. All right, press it down. Like I said, you're gonna get a little glue on your fingers, but that's okay. Come on, whiskers. There we go. Okay, try not to touch it, but if you do, it's not a big deal. It'll dry, okay? All right, so then you're gonna grab your marker 
and you are going to draw his eyebrows. So just a little, little line, a little hump right above his eyes, and then you're gonna draw his mouth. There we go. And then you are going to grab his bow tie. Um, and let's glue right on the bow tie, actually. I think that'll be easiest to glue on the paper, okay? All right, I think that'll hold it down. Flip it over, there we go. Now, we are going to apply his hat. Now, this part might be a little tricky, but we can get through it, okay? So, you're going to grab the first part, the big, the long white strip, and that's going to be um, the first part of his hat. So, for this strip, you can actually apply right to the paper if you want. I'm just going to do that because it's a little faster. Alright, now with the other strips, it's going to be a little bit different, okay? Um, you're going to grab the, the red strip and actually um, you're going to put it on the bottom of the strip. Okay. And then you're going to lift up the white strip and you're going to put it right underneath it, okay? All right. So you're going to do the same thing. Now it's a pattern, white, red, white. So you're going to do, you're going to add again some glue to the white strip. All right, uh, might be a little bit tricky. There we go, gotta lift up the white, or I'm sorry, the red strip. I'm lifting up the whole thing, but that's okay. All right, oh, it's shifting, that's okay. All right. All right, and now you're going to grab the red the red strip. And add the glue again. Maybe this one will be a little bit easier to apply. And I think so. You can just lift it. There you go. Oh, it's moving. All right, and press it down. You can lift up the red strip. Put it above, there we go. Put it above the white strip. And one more strip to go, and then we are all done with his hat. And I think actually we'll be done with the craft. All right. All right, I think we are done. Make sure you press down the different pieces. Now this craft does require some draw some drying because there is a lot of glue applied, but I think it'll be okay. Um, but yeah, I think we are done. We got all our pieces on. I hope you had fun making this craft. 
All right. I will see you guys next week. Thanks for joining me. Bye.